Play a fun. See ya. Family what's going on? It's your boyfriend Panisa here. That's correct. Any other is not to feed. Don't forget. Yo, family, welcome back to the Utaka Career Game Mode in FIFA 20. Um, this is gonna be the second time I playing Utaka Career. So please let me know though if you guys wanna see like every single game in this journey, or if you just wanna see like highlight games, which will make it a lot quicker. Um I can keep this video short because you guys have short attention spans and I really am about doing a 30 minute video when I could do something quick and let you guys enjoy it. Anyways, today we're going to do training because last time I spoke about training and how important it is. So we are going to training and we can basically add training drills in each of the five slots that you see here. So we know that we're sent to attacking mid. So some of the things we need to work on for sure is dribbling. So we're going to do something that seems hard, but it's actually easy. So if you look down here in the um, bottom right, you see the um, abilities or whatever being upgraded. So you got sprint speed, agility, ball control, and dribbling being upgraded. If you go down here to this one, one on one bucket race, you see agility, ball control, and dribbling are the only ones being upgraded. Um, but we can work with this one for now, which is risk against the clock. This is a pretty easy one, even though it says hard. So we can use this as our first slot. Another thing I want to show you guys is set piece. I actually want to be the guy doing the set piece um, free kicks. This one says it's hard, but it's pretty easy. So we, we're going to do that one and we're going to walk through. How to take free kicks in FIFA 20. Um, for sure, we gotta do some defending. We're gonna do the easy one just because our defending is pretty poor right now. We're sent to attacking mid, so defense is not in our game at all. So we need that in. Um, it's best to go easy for defending because difficult is just gonna make it very hard for you to tackle unless you are really good at tackling. But we can keep it easy for now. Um, shooting not really passing we're going to do a hard passing drill just to walk you guys through it is really not that hard so we're going to do this one and get the maximum um what you call it the maximum progress possible so the harder the training the more progress you get as you can see there um in slot three where you see tackle practice that's only like upgrading my thing from 43 to a little bit like a like a if of the entire bar whereas if you go to pass to the mini net you see it up a little bit more so that's that let's see let's see if we can add one more um thing here this is medium this one is medium this one's pretty easy too so we, can, so we can go through all of these practice sessions and I can walk you through how to take free kicks. So you get a little bonus in this video. Anyways, let's bring in training. I feel like I talk a bit much there, like four minutes gone already. So the job is to sprint through the cones using the analog and the R2 button. As you can see, it's not that difficult. This is a nice, quick, easy way to, to get a lot of points and to boost your player speed, agility, dribbling. You really don't have to rush it, just take your time. The further ahead you are um, against the other player, the more points you get so that was pretty easy let's try next player so this is like free kick taking and i can watch you so many things that you need to look out for when you're trying to take free kicks now this player overall is like 60 something it's not that great so you want to aim load up and leave it Ooh, hit the post really One of the things you gotta do is time your kick. Now, after you load up, you gotta time your kick by pressing circle again. The way you do that 
is wait until the player lifts his foot and then press circle again. And I bet you, you get good timing on all your shots. So load up, wait until he lift. Okay. As you can see, this player free kit is pretty poor. Like, there's not much you can do about that. Just, just kick and hope, basically, because you can see the ball is going pretty high. He has no free kick power. Free kick accuracy is on low. So you got to get your timing right. And you hit the target every single time. That's what you have to do, hit the target for this one. So that's excellent. Um, train next player. So this is tackling, it's pretty easy. All you basically have to do is walk in the direction of the player and the guy will tackle for you. That's all you have to do. This is really easy. I almost miss you. Tackles. Simple. And the player like runs straight too. So it's, it's not like they're dribbling to really try to get past you. It's just for you to get your timing right. I'm not even pressing circle guys. So that's how easy this one is. I'm gonna skip that. passing to the mini net this one is pretty easy all you have to do is bring the ball to one side and pass on that one side take attacker just like that pass to the net now on the second turn the other defender comes in pass to the middle then pass on the same side just like that it's not that difficult you get the hang of it we come this side works on both sides so turn yo almost miss let's take it boom 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 and then you can really sprint because the second defender is the only guy that runs for the ball pass to there oh one more same thing oh almost got it It's really not that hard, people. Analog and X is the name of the drill. No, taking penalties. These these ones can tend to be a bit difficult because you have to hold the analog in the position. After you press circle, you can let go. You can't even let go, sorry. After you press. So as you can see, this guy's aim and everything is pretty poor. So you want to look at that bar after you press circle look at that bar and try to time it in the green or you can follow my rule of as soon as a player lifts their foot to kick the ball get it in so really in that hard that's the truth oh, i might have to do this again or not Last chance to get excellent. Oh my god. Good job. Uh, if I was not doing a video, I would probably do it over. But because you guys got short attention spans, like 9 minutes gone already, I know you guys didn't stay for this long. Um, so advance. If I play a game now, the game is 5 minutes and a half. Forget it. Anyways, people. There's me a boy Flink just showing you some of the training that you can go through. No, if you guys want me to um, do different training sessions, I will do that. Just let me know in the section below, in the comment section below. I'll look at that comment and I will try to apply it to this. Uh, anyways, I can stop this video now. That's the training video. And then I can start another video and going to a game. So, before we any further talk, it's been a boy Flint. I hope you tune into the next video for the game after this training session. So yeah, it's been a boy Flint. I'll see you later, family. Peace.